In the world of AI, a recent tweet from Stephen H. Hill, who was part of the team at OpenAI, sparked quite a conversation. He tweeted, Brace yourselves, AGI is coming. This tweet was a reaction to something Jan Leakey, also from OpenAI, said. Jan tweeted about a new way OpenAI is planning to deal with the risks that come with advanced AI systems, the kind that are powerful and could potentially be dangerous if not handled correctly. Now let's dive into what this all means. OpenAI is working on something called a preparedness framework. Think of this as a set of rules or a plan to make sure that the AI technology they develop is safe and doesn't cause any unexpected problems. As AI gets more advanced, there's a chance it could do things we don't want it to do or even harm people. So this framework is really important to make sure everything stays under control. A big part of this framework is about understanding how risky different AI systems could be. OpenAI wants to have a way to measure this, kind of like a scorecard. This scorecard will help them see how much of a risk an AI model is. If an AI system is too risky, they might decide not to use it or to change it. Let's talk about some of the risks they're looking at. First up is cybersecurity. This is about the danger of AI being used to break into computer systems or cause trouble in them. If AI gets really good at this, it could be used in the wrong way, like hacking into important systems or stealing people's information. OpenAI wants to make sure their AI can't be used for these kinds of things. Another big risk area is what they call CBRN. That's chemical, biological, radiological, and nuclear threats. This is about the chance that AI could help make dangerous things like biological weapons. It's scary to think about, but if AI makes it easier to create these kinds of harmful materials, we could have a big problem on our hands. The framework is there to stop AI from being used in ways that could help make these dangerous materials. Then there's the topic of persuasion. This is about AI convincing people to believe or do certain things. It's especially worrying when you think about how this could be used in things like elections. Imagine an AI that's so good at persuading people that it can sway an entire election. That's something OpenAI is trying to prevent with this framework. Autonomy in AI models is another important point. This means AI systems that can make themselves better or work on their own without people telling them what to do. This kind of AI could be hard to control, and that's why OpenAI is keeping a close eye on it. They want to make sure these AI systems always have someone watching over them and can't go off doing things on their own. Now there's also talk about GPT-5, which is the next big thing OpenAI is working on creating. GPT-5 has been a big job and it sounds like it's been stressful for the people at OpenAI. This might be because making such an advanced AI system is a really big deal. They have to make sure it's not just powerful, but also safe and follows all their rules. This preparedness framework isn't just a one-time thing. It's going to change and get better as OpenAI learns more. They had a whole team focused on keeping an eye on the safety of their AI. This team approach is really helpful because it means they can look at the risks from all different angles. This makes it less likely they'll miss something important. So, what does all this mean? Well, OpenAI is taking big steps to make sure that the AI they create, like GPT-5, is made in a responsible way. They know that these AI systems can be really powerful, and they want to be sure they're used in a way that's safe and doesn't hurt anyone. This is a big deal in the tech world, where people are starting to realize how important it is to think about the ethics of AI. OpenAI's preparedness framework shows that they're serious about making AI that's not just smart, but also safe and good for everyone. As AI technology keeps advancing, it's going to be more and more important to think about these things. We're entering a world where AI can do a lot, and that's exciting, but it also means we have to be careful. It's like having a really powerful tool, you have to use it wisely and make sure it's not going to cause any harm. OpenA's work on this framework is a big step in that direction. They're trying to be ahead of the game, thinking about all the possible risks and how to handle them. In the end, what's really interesting is how OpenAI is not just focusing on making their AI smarter, but also safer. It's about finding the right balance between advancing technology and keeping everyone safe. This is going to be a big challenge, but it looks like OpenAI is up for it. They're putting a lot of thought and effort into this, and it's going to be really interesting to see how it all plays out. All right, if you found this interesting and want to stay updated on more AI insights like this, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.